to see how to use linear programming problems to optimize the solutions to real life problems. So as the word linear suggests, linear programming problems mean solving real life problems by the use of linear equations subject to certain conditions. Linear programming in mathematics means devising an optimal solution to the problem such as maximizing profit, minimizing cost, etc. under some restrictions such as number of workers, number of hours, number of machines or the number of available um, or the amount available. We know how to solve linear inequalities manually. Let's see and try to understand sharing the wanted reasons and devising the common solution to the given set of linear inequalities. For example, by the use of GDC, share the wanted reasons of the following linear inequalities x less than or equal to 6, y less than or equal to 6, and y greater than or equal to 4 minus x. These are three simultaneous linear inequalities. And hence, find the least and the greatest possible value of 3x plus 2y subject to the above inequalities. First of all, press apps and press number 7 and then press enter and then set up the inequalities press enter Just choose your color of choice for example first inequality is y is greater than or equal to 4 minus x so we can we can move the cursor to whichever side we want so we can set the inequality sign y greater than or equal to so we can y greater than 4 minus x, 4 minus x, uh, 4 minus x. So, graph, so you can see the graph. Again, we go to y equal to the second inequality is y. Set up the sign of the inequality. Same procedure. Repeat the same process for the second inequality. y less than or equal to 6. You can select the color of your choice. Less than or equal to 6 graph. And then the third inequality. The third inequality is a vertical line x equal to 6 or x less than or equal to 6. So you see this x equal to. So we take our cursor to x equal to. Press enter. Now we set up inequality for x equal to. Press enter. We can choose different color. Let's say pink color or any color. So x less than or equal to 6 less than or equal to 6 and then we enter enter so then we enter the value of x less than or equal to 6 and then we graph now we have the solution shown where the three colors you see the blue pink and orange color are overlapping so that triangular reason you can see the triangular reason so the way these lines are intersecting these lines are these points are known as corner points so we can easily calculate the corner points by going to second trace because we want to maximize or minimize we want to see the least or greatest value of it 3x plus 2y so value at x is equal to 2 uh, yeah x is equal to we can see negative 2 because here this value is negative 2 so we can choose negative 2 and corresponding value is y is equal to 6 so negative 2 6 when we substitute in 3x plus 2 y so we will get value is equal to you know uh, value of the function which we have to optimize is 6 after substituting into 3x plus 2 y okay then we have the second value when x is equal to 6 when x is equal to 6 we will get two values i think so y is equal to negative 2 so when we substitute x is equal to 6 y is equal to negative 2 the 3x plus 2y will give us 10 that is the second um, lar largest value first was 6 now it's 10 okay 
now again second trace mm, value x is equal to 6 so we can see when x is equal to 6 we have two values x is equal to 6 y is equal to 6 so three corner points so at these three corner points when you substitute into 3x plus 2y at this point we get the maximum value so that is the greatest value that is 30 and here we have when we put x is equal to negative 2 and y is equal to 6 we get 6 so that is the least possible value